have started the car. Yes, and we think we know what the issue is. We do. Let me see. Are there any codes? No. I see no codes, Amy. No codes. Not even a check engine light. Yay. Uh, you know what? Again, it's freezing. It's Canada. It's winter. And uh, I'm going to come in, all right? Come on in. But actually, let's show the car. Let oh, yeah. Come. Let's show the car. We don't yeah. get in. Enough pictures of the car or video of the car. Could you do a burnout now? Uh, no, but I could drive around you slowly. Our vehicle stability control light came on, basically said it was off and not working, and it for sure was not working. This car, <laughs> the car was, was crazy. Crazy in this winter wonderland. Right. I talked with a guy uh, on YouTube today who is from. Uh, uh, the Arab Emirates, and he was like, oh, no, everybody here has their VSC <laughs> off. They never worry about it. I'm like, of course, you guys don't have snow, but yeah. we have ice and snow, and you need it on. So here's the thing. We had two codes in the car. Right now, we just have the one thing that always drives us crazy, which is the tail lamp failure. One was the uh, 0430 code, right, which was about the, uh, um, that's about the catalytic converter. We don't care. Uh, but the other one was 1349 P1349 and that is a uh, solenoid on top of the on top of the engine and mm -hmm. dang it so uh, our good friend uh, Brad Boo thank, Fighter right? thank you Brad call out to Boo Fighter call out to Boo Fighter yeah, check him out and subscribe he has a 2001 LS just like this one except it's gold anyways he brought a code reader and we took a look at it and he read the codes as we uh, were told by many people we should, and we did, and that was the right thing to do. Uh, so, 1349 solenoid, and then he cleared the codes. And that <laughs> means that right now, again, look at that clean, almost, dashboard, right? And more importantly, our vehicle stability control works. It does. <laughs> it was so different. When I drove to meet him, I was like, please don't run off the road, run off the road. And then afterward, it was like driving the normal car. And so... Yeah. Uh, we'll have to see whether or not we need to replace it or if it just tripped the code. Yeah. I've read a couple things. Some people say it'll, you know, it'll run fine for a day or a week or two weeks and then it'll trip the code. Mm. Uh, others say that it cleared it once and that was that. I don't know what it is. Yeah. We've never had the code before and it tripped again going through the drive through of a coffee shop. Makes no sense at all. No. But thank you guys for your um, support and suggestions and checking it out having the codes looked at and yeah and what should they do subscribe <laughs> <laughs> please and thank you